Presidential candidate Ron Paul bringing his quest for the Republican nomination to Detroit today. Yeah, the congressman from Texas offers views much different from his GOP rivals. And today, Fox 2's Bill Gallagher tells us Paul's Michigan campaign could actually draw votes from Mitt Romney or Rick Santorum. Ron Paul appeared before an enthusiastic crowd in a former Jewish temple, now part of the Little Rock Baptist Church complex. Many in the crowd were young. Paul, a libertarian, spoke out against cradle-to-grave government roles in people's lives and excessive government spending. He wants a lower U.S. profile on the global stage. He says the system is not working. The evidence is so clear. It's not working. And this is what I think is happening in the last four or five years. The people are sick and tired of the wars, and they're sick and tired of this weak economy right now. Paul called for tax credits for homeschooling, more charter schools, and he lashed out against the bank or any other government bailouts. He blasted the war on drugs as wasteful and ineffective, and he said the poor and minorities are inordinately prosecuted in drug cases. He denounced mandatory sentences for nonviolent drug offenders. I warn all of them, as I warn everybody, drugs are very, very dangerous. Of course, the drug war is even more dangerous. That's our problem. Paul spoke out against what he called intrusions on liberties that came after the 9-11 attacks. This is the opportunity. This is the time we can do this because we need more control over the people. And that was called the Patriot Act. They passed that within two weeks. Now, I don't think the Patriot Act would have been passed if it would have been called repeal the Fourth Amendment Act. (laughs) Paul is gaining popularity with young voters. Why do you think so many young people are drawn around Paul? Um, I think it's because he represents all of us. He represents the future. We see what's going on in the world and the economy today, and he is the one that provides the solutions for those. Paul scoffs at the notion he's drawing votes from Rick Santorum to help Mitt Romney, a charge the Santorum camp is making. Well, if that's all he has to talk about, he's forgotten that we're in a campaign because we're in too many wars, we're spending too much money, we have a debt crisis. If he thinks that's an issue, he's just kidding himself because it's not true. In recent days, several prominent Republican leaders have spoken about the problems that division in the party could mean in the November election. Ron Paul discounts that. I think I've heard that for many, many elections over 20, 30 years. Oh, you can't, you can't have these debates. It'll ruin the general. But, you know, uh, so often they come together right afterwards. I mean. In Detroit, Bill Gallagher, Fox 2 News.